You look so cute. Did you pick out your bow? Yeah? It's super cute. Pink? Yeah. yeah. What'd you say? Pink bow. Is that what you said? It is pink. Hi, baby Eloise. Hi, pretty girl. It's Tuesday. I look ragged. I'll eat bow. I'll eat bow. I'll eat bow. Eloise, I don't know if it's a growth spurt, but she's eating a lot at night. Like, she's waking up more, but she's genuinely eating. So, we're just, we're just dealing with it, right? Her neck is looking worse again. Let's see if we can get a good, look up here. I know, it's really hard not to look at the camera. See? It's just looking chapped again. So, I sent some messages to her pediatrician with some photos, and we'll see what she wants us to do. I called, and they said, just go ahead and send some pictures over. This, this little lady right here is needing a lot of mommy time. So the plan is, as soon as Eloise goes down for her nap, which is in a half hour, Lyndall and I are gonna go on a date this morning, just her and I. It's gonna be super fun. That's why I love having Tuesdays off and Carrie here, so that I can, whoever needs me, I can spend more. You want mommy to stand up? Yeah. I'm going to in just a second because I need to put some makeup on so that I can look like I'm among the living <laughs> instead of not. <laughs> that was a good hug. Uh, so I'm going to put a little makeup on. <laughs> I want to organize my bathroom though. That's one thing I have on my list that I want to accomplish this morning. So I don't think it'll take very long. I just need to do it. I'm going to go through all my makeup and all my drawers here and get that stuff organized, and then get some makeup on, put Eloise down, and then go on a date. Is it gonna be fun? You know how much I love you? Yeah. You do? I love it. Mommy loves mommy. Bear loves mommy? Yeah. Do you love mommy? Yeah. You do? Does Eloise love mommy? Yeah. Oh, good. Hi, yeah. sweetie pie. Hi, sweetie pie. You're so pretty. Oh. Oh. Hopefully I look a bit more pulled together now. My makeup takes me about five minutes to do. <laughs> I don't do anything fancy. I probably don't do anything correctly either. It's just what I've always done. And fortunately I didn't lose my eyebrows to the 90s. I know a lot of people like over plucked and it, they just like didn't grow back, which I can't imagine. Now that like thicker, fuller eyebrows are back in, they have to, pencil them in. I'm probably supposed to be doing something with my eyebrows. If you know of like any good YouTube makeup artists that can do something quick with eyebrows that I should be doing, please let me know in the comments because I could use some help in that arena. I've got my little sidekick right here. She's a happy girl. Hi, happy girl. Hi, sweetie pie. Um, and I'm gonna try to tackle this here. I'm gonna try to go with three categories. First category is what I'm currently using. Second category is what I can still use in the future. And third category is just what I'm not using. And so what I'm not using, I'm gonna get rid of or duplicate things like duplicate tweezers that don't, that I just don't need, things like that. I need to put all of my hair deals in one. Like I got this organizer and then look what I did. This is ridiculous. So I'm gonna go through and kind of divvy this stuff up into those three categories and then repeat on my next drawer, next drawer. Luckily, those two have hardly anything in them and then repeat with these, which also have hardly anything in them. So that's the plan. This is the makeup I use every day. So I just keep it in this little pouch because sometimes I need to grab it quickly and take it out to the front bathroom and do my makeup out there. Like when I need to go to work on Thursday afternoons and the kids, I have the kids. I'll do my makeup in the front bathroom so that I can keep an eye on them too. Luckily, it doesn't take me very long. So that is automatically gonna be kept. This is the perfume I've used for years since I met Brad. That's a side note, but I love it. There's a couple of different fragrances in this type of Chanel Chance, and this is the one, the green one, that I love. All right, let's get started. First, I need to like Let's do the only handle it once thing and I'll just pull everything out and put it in their respective piles. <laughs>
Uh, poor bear. He, this, this whole concept is new, so he was a little bit upset that he wasn't coming in the car too, and it broke my heart. I tried to explain next week he gets to come in the car, but obviously that doesn't make sense to a two-year-old. And it didn't help that he had like just stubbed his toe right before we left, so it was, it was kind of sad. But this is good. We need to do some one-on-one -on -one time. And Lyndall, we are gonna have so much fun. Let's go to Starbucks. Yeah. Okay, and then do you wanna get our nails done? You wanna get your nails painted pretty? And then pick out a book? Yay, nails! All right, let's do it. Yeah. All right, Junebug, you ready to get your nails done? Yeah. Gonna fix your bow. Oh my goodness. There we go. All right, so this is gonna be perfect. You wanna hold my hand? This is gonna be perfect because we're here at the nail place. In the same parking lot behind us is, over there is Starbucks. And also in the same parking lot is a bookstore. Stonecrest Book and Toy is where I usually go to get like gifts for anybody that we're going to a birthday party for. Uh, the kids books, it's just a great way to support local. They have Usborne books in there, which we love. If you haven't heard us talk about those, you should check out Usborne books. They're really like interactive and kids love them. So we'll probably get our nails done, get a treat from Starbucks, and then go pick out a book and a present for Bear. Does that sound good? Okay. You already picked your color. You did you look at all of them? Look how many there are? One, two. All right. So which one do you want? You want that one? What about any of these over here? You like that one? Oh, that one's so pretty. Good choice, Lyndall. Good choice. All right. This is the color you want. What color is that? Pink. It's pink. So we're gonna have to take the red off of your nails first. Yeah. You wanna put your hand up there? She's gonna take off the nail polish. Other hand. There you go. You're a pro. <laughs> Relax your hand. There you go. Is this fun? <laughs> we see your nails. Oh, those are so pretty. Do you love them? Yeah. So we're just walking through. Uh, this is the Stonecrest Mall. I thought it was fizzling out, but then it was sort of revived when a community college took up some of the space. It's real pretty in here. And it connects through to the bookstore. So we're gonna run over to the bookstore and pick out a book. You wanna go in that one? That's a CBD, <laughs> a store that sells CBD oil. You're not quite old enough for that yet. <laughs> Okay, let's see what else they have. Ooh, how about a boat lift? You wanna look at boat lifts? <laughs> Ooh, those are big ladders. Cool. Dock lockers. You could check out some hearing aids. Oh, they're closed, it looks like. Dang it. You wanna get your taxes filed? I almost tripped. You almost tripped. How about some vape vaping? Well, dang, the bookstore is through there, and that door doesn't open. So we have to go outside and go back into the bookstore. Just real quick. You want me to hold you? Okay. I love you very much. Okay. Do you love me? Yeah. Do you love Bear? Yeah. Do you love Eloise? Yeah. Oh, good. Hey, okay, we're here. Look at that unicorn. Do you want to go see it? Let's go look at it. Wow, cool. I was about to say you can pick one thing, but I don't want it to be that. That's a 
that's a big unicorn. Oh my gosh, that was cute. Do you love him? I wonder how many other kids have done that. Who is that? Frosty the Snowman. This one's Olaf. It's Olaf. Who's this? Who's this one? Who is that? Oh, this one. You want to hold it? What's his name? Do you remember? What's, what's he call him? Come on! Sven? Is it Sven? Yeah? <laughs> Come on, Sven! Come on, Sven! <laughs> it's like your favorite line in the whole movie. Oh. I guess we're not... I guess we're not nice and soft. Yep, you can throw things that are soft. Probably not in a store, though. Oh, a baby. Kind of like the one you're holding. You actually do have that baby. This is really cool. Green toys, 100% recycled plastic. Packaging looks like it's totally recyclable. Neat. Are they so soft? Wow, that one's furry. Oh, it's so soft. Ooh, that's cute, a little doggy. Is that one soft too? This is funny. <laughs>instructions are to pick one book that's Lindell's one book for you and then one book for bear what should that looks fun this one, this one. you think that one do you want to look at any more of them you kind of just went straight to the very first ones you saw the girl knows what she wants those two okay that is a good choice for bear Dalmatian and a digger he's really gonna like that I don't like that one. you like that one people just sit and read books and be nice to each other. No kidding. Oh, you're going to sit on that? I don't know if that's... That looks kind of like an antique. That's really cute, though. That's fun! So this is cool. All bargain books. Buy one, get one free. All gently used. Let's look at these, too. So this is definitely new. This uh, Goblet of Fire illustrated version. That's book four. Initially, they just had books one through three, so I am definitely, definitely picking this up. I'll put it with our pile here, and then maybe, maybe pick a couple of these used books here. Open the door. Open the door. Hey, they have magnetiles here. Fun. Oh my gosh, we have no self-control. I grabbed a few more. <laughs> All right, dinosaur or safari? Which one, dinosaur or dinosaur? Good choice. Look right here. What do you want to hold? The turtle. The turtle? Hey, you know what? There's a real one right here. <laughs> hey, turtle. Hey, turtle. Be soft. <coughs> wow. That is so cool. He has a name, I can't remember what his name is. Turtle. His name is Turtle. Neat. <laughs> Hi, my name is Hemingway, but I am a girl, so please don't call me Ernest. It's a girl. Her name is Hemingway.
Can you say Hemingway? Hemingway. Yeah, it's a girl turtle. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't she pretty? Oh, that was so nice. Mmm, lemon cake. Did Lyndall get you this book? Do you love it? Yeah. It has a digger on it. Cool. And a quick after of what she looks like now that I've decluttered. So this is just my everyday makeup that I can move around if I need to. Some extra stuff if I have time to do like eyeshadow. Eyeshadow, this is a highlighting palette. And then I've just put all of my extra stuff in here. So as I run out of this stuff, then I'll look here first to see if I have a backup. Obviously, I still have some stuff to do. Yeah. Yeah. But I think I'm going to take Bear now to go on a little date. 